Sinead O'Connor fans have been left devastated after a memorial outside her old childhood home in Ireland has vanished. The 56-year-old sadly died in July this year, and a shrine was created outside the property in Bray, County Wicklow by her devoted fans, who were mourning the singer's tragic death. Sinead was found dead in London, and her death wasn't treated as suspicious. In a statement announcing the heartbreaking news, her family said, It is with great sadness that we announce the passing of our beloved Sinead. Her family and friends are devastated and have requested privacy at this very difficult time. Her death came almost 18 months after her son Shane, 17, died by suicide. Fans lovingly tended to the memorial outside her childhood home, and more than 6,000 fans gathered there when Sinead's funeral cortege passed through the seaside town ahead of her private burial. Cards, letters and stones with messages of condolence were placed outside the property, but fans have recently discovered that the shrine has now disappeared, along with a pink chair that was similar to the one the Irish hitmaker used to sit on. Where have all our mementos gone? What harm were the tributes doing? One fan posted on social media. However, it later emerged that the tributes were removed to keep them safe, in the hope of using them in a permanent tribute to the iconic singer in her hometown of Bray, according to The Sun. But now the shrine has vanished, mourning fans are struggling to locate the singer's old home, and neighbors were stunned at how quickly it was cleared. I couldn't believe how quickly it disappeared. I thought it would take a long time but it was literally cleared overnight, one neighbor explained, as they said it was done in a gentle way, and hoped that people would now move on from grieving the loss of the singer. One fan took to Twitter to share their views on a permanent memorial to Sinead, and suggested that the shrine could be relocated in a museum dedicated to the singer. Would it not be a better idea to have a Sinead O'Connor museum dedicated to her music and causes she championed? A GoFund page could fund a foundation to oversee project with local representation and memorial monument could be erected near Strand, they wrote. A huge memorial is being planned online by fans who will be traveling to Bray in July next year on the one-year anniversary of her death but some have been put off due to the shrine being removed without permission. I'm bringing a special tribute for Sinead with me. I'll now put it somewhere else, one furious fan posted. Owners of the house, who purchased the property from Sinead in 2021 for just under £1 million, reportedly want to turn it into a block of luxury flats. Back in April, Wicklow County Council refused permission for the house, called Montebello, to be turned into apartments, and the developers appealed to overturn the decision, which they said is not justified. A decision is expected later this month. Follow Mirror Celebs on Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube and Threads.